What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mike Lemon coming back with an update on my 75 gallon reef tank. If you guys have been following along, I've been running this tank for a little over six weeks now and I am enjoying it. Um, I haven't really had a reef tank for about a year now and it's good to have this thing up and running. Um, it's nice to see some fish. I got some coral in the tank and it's cool to see some movement. I'm, uh, I'm excited to wake up in the morning, uh, test my alkalinity, check everything out and uh, we are back up and running. Uh, your boy's got a reef tank again, so check it out. So since my last update, um, I threw some coral in here, got like some zoas in here, I got this little hammer that's loving life. Um, some more zoas. This is some kind of little war coral that I don't know if I'm gonna keep, uh, but it's in there. It's doing all right. It's just not the most colorful, so I don't know if I'll keep it. Uh, got some more zoas. This little thing's kind of cool. If you guys can see that, I don't know how good the lighting is. There it is. Um, that is a rainbow Monty. It doesn't show the best color under the T5s, but I got high hopes for that thing and I hope it's gonna color up and look really cool um, in a little bit. But as you see, the polyps are extending um, and it looks all right. Uh, right above that, I threw some Rosses to the right, some other Chaos down there, and then this is like some Eagle Eyes or something. Um, when I get these lights over the tank, that should look pretty awesome. Uh, some more Zoas, got this hammer that I've had for a couple years now. That thing is real puffy, doing real well. Um, the six lines doing good, all the rest of the fish, the neon dotty back, the clowns, the um, my yellow watchmen, they're all doing good. The chromis is doing good. Uh, everybody is doing pretty well. A little frag rack over here, everything's doing all right. Um, Zoers are growing, they're looking good. Shrimp's crushing it, he's always running around having fun. Um, so the tank is doing well as we speak, I mean, I've been um, kind of testing everything here and there and it seems doing all right. I ended up adding, since we last talked, this green Slimer. It doesn't color up the best under these T5s, but it's uh, it seems to be doing all right. I got some polyp extension and it seems to be um, doing okay. So once I get everything dialed in, which I'll talk about here in a second, uh, it should be doing all right. So it's looking pretty good. I'm happy so far. Uh, I might make a change with uh, the gyre guy. I, I don't really care for it. I think these other style, you know, the normal wave pumps do a better job. And I ended up buying another JBO. Um, I bought a little smaller one, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with that yet. Um, like I said, T5s are still on it. Um, I got four, four bulb T5, but I'm really only running two blue plus and a purple plus, I think. Um, and of course things be happy so once i finish my canopy which i started i got the frame in there um, i will be able to somehow attach those ais to the top of the inside of the canopy um so yeah we got still got a lot of stuff to do let's check out the sub see what's going on down here um it's doing all right skimmer i'm still trying to dial in a little bit um it seems like it changes day to day so that thing's doing all right um, my light's not on yet, but it might even click on here in a minute. But the Chato is certainly growing uh, since the last video. So that's cool to see. It's nice to see growth. Um, over here, Kimura running. And even cooler to talk about, your boy's calcium reactor is up and running. I got the new pump back from um, BRS. They sent me a new pump. We, we, we hashed out a deal and I put the pH probe in there. I got this CO2 cranking and I am doing all right. So right now, I don't know if you can see it, 45 mils a minute. That's what I'm running for the time being. I'm trying to dial this thing in. Um, I've been sitting between like, when I first started, I was like 8.3. I dialed it down, I was at eight. And then I went to seven, eight. I noticed today, today it was, or yesterday was seven, seven. I, I adjusted slightly. Now I'm back up to seven, eight. So I am gonna try and keep uh, my alkalinity, uh, for a good starting point, keep it around eight. Uh, and that's what I'm gonna run. I'm gonna let the corals decide what I do with it. Uh, but as it sits right now, everything seems to be running all right. I'm, I'm happy with what I got going on so far. Temperature's good, salinity's good. I ended up getting my Hannah uh, salinity checker um, and it seems to be doing all right. 
I had to adjust it a little bit. I had to bring my salinity up a little bit, but so far we are doing good. Um, you see right there, it's like a slow bubble once every like four or five seconds. Uh, might be off of there it goes. Um, but yeah, the calcium reactor is up and running and your boy is pumped. I can't wait to stuff this thing full of sticks. I know it's gonna take some time. I know my tank's only running for uh, like six or seven weeks, but I, uh, I got high hopes for this tank. I plan to do, I haven't done one yet, but I'm thinking about ordering like a 30 or 40 gallon brute, maybe like a 40 and probably doing like a 30 gallon water change. I haven't done one yet, but uh, it's in the works. I already have about 40, 50, about 50 gallons worth of uh, RO made. And that is uh, on the agenda for the next week or so. So I'm gonna do that. And another thing I ordered, um, I went to bed on Thursday night, turned my RO, totally forgot that I had my RO unit running. So I woke up and heard water running and I ran downstairs, of course, it was overflowed. I uh, just had a little 10 gallon brute, um, pissed me off. I, I kind of didn't completely ruin the floor because there was like a little um, pitch to the floor. So it kind of all drained out into one little side. So it, it took me all, all Friday, last Friday to uh, clean that up. So I ended up ordering the Flood Guardian. So that I believe is supposed to be here tomorrow. So that'll be pretty cool. I ordered some more um, alkalinity reagent got that coming. I ordered some lube for the Kimura pump uh, that came in today. So I lubed it up a little bit and it is running properly. I used to have like a little squeak uh, and that is gone. Other than that, I don't know. We're getting to the point where I'm going to uh, start buying some more coral and trying to fill this thing up a little bit. I know it's going to take a long time before it's the way I want it, but as it sits right now, we are up and running. I'm pretty happy so far. So that is my call it a six week update and we are looking pretty good. So other than that, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down low. Uh, and I appreciate you guys watching again. If you guys ever see me live streaming, jump in, say what up, join the stream and uh, we'll have a good time. Other than that, I appreciate it guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Your boy Mike Lemon is out. Peace.